Hey, fancy beauties and bows, welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Gina, and I'm coming in with a clean with me video. This is a video to deep clean for fall and just to kind of relieve some stress. You know what I mean? So sometimes I use actually all the time I use cleaning as a therapeutic measure you know because you're cleaning and everything is becoming fresh and beautiful all over again and it just makes me feel so good inside so I wanted to go ahead and share this video with you all today I've got some new products that I'm using this product that I'm using on the table here is really really excellent it gives me the ability to clean my mirror products my mirrored furniture and it doesn't leave streaks behind at least very minimal and I am the worst person <laughs> when it comes to streak free mirrored furniture like there's gonna be some streaks once I'm done. So I tried Windex and I, I'm trying this now. I picked this up from Burke's Outlet, I believe. It was either there or it was Target. Uh, not Target, but TJ Maxx. So I'm not sure which, but I'm absolutely in love with this product. So I'm gonna leave that information either on the screen or in the description bar or both. So now I have a nice, clean, fresh mirrored table, and I decided to take that vase away, and I put a pop of color there instead, and I took that vase and I put it under my other mirrored table, and I believe you guys will see that in one of the clips here. I'm not sure, but hopefully you will. I'm still in love with those candle holders. They are so classy and elegant. They really, really spiff up a section that you may want to put them in. I'm still on the search for trying to find something different to put in for the candle card. Uh, I don't know if I want to go with a live candle or if I just want to let it be with the LED and maybe just do something with the color it's, it's the color that's throwing me off so we'll see what we work out with that so I've been looking into a new rug for underneath this table here that rug that's there now, I picked that up from Walmart and it's kind of clashing with everything that I have in my head on how I want things to look. So, plus it's, it's worn, you know, so that's why I don't mind when the kids drop food or whatever on it, it's okay. It's worn and it's time for it to come up. So I'm just sweeping so I can get ready to clean the hardwood floors. For the hardwood floors, I use the Murphy wood cleaner, and so far it works pretty good for me. I don't have any issues with it. This is the table that I was speaking of where I ended up putting that vase underneath. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take everything off. Of course, wipe it down as well with this lovely product that I spoke to you guys about earlier. And then we're just gonna put everything back pretty much the way that it was. See, just little effort I have to put into getting this go back into there. And then I'll 
show you guys how that looks lit up at night. I have a clip that I can show you on that. And it looks so serene and so peaceful. Yes, I have to have everything perfect. <laughs> I keep touching moving stuff around because it's got to be just right when I look at it. And here we are. Let's move on to the living room table and that was just me showing my Bible. I keep it out and I keep it out on Psalms 34. I had to end up putting some new tabs uh, sticky tabs on this table I'm considering changing out this table set as well I'm not sure because I really like the design of this so I don't know I might spiff it up or something leave it the way it is I'm not sure at this point we'll make those decisions later down the line but now we're just going to keep it nice and clean and tight and yes this product works good on glass furniture as well. In my little table decor right here, the tray I picked that up from Burks and the little spiky balls I picked that up from Burks as well. And I believe that little vase with the flower in it I want to say I picked that up from Brooks as well. Maybe. No, it was Home Goods. It was Home Goods. So we're just moving the furniture and I'm just going to sweep everywhere. That DIY on that entertainment system, <laughs> if I can speak correctly, is coming up real soon. I had to get some mirror pieces cut for it. So I have to put those on and then I can go ahead and bring that video to you guys as well. That's paint I'm picking up or cleaning up off the artwork. Luckily, it came up pretty easy because it's chalk paint, so I didn't have an issue getting that up. Now, my fun part. This is really the time I can really just think and figure things out. With, just relax is when I'm washing dishes. A lot of people like to put the dishes in the dishwasher, but this is the time I can just, you know, think about things and talk to God and just be one with myself because I'm so busy nowadays I don't get a chance to just be one with myself so this is my time to be to myself and just reflect on whatever thoughts that I'm having or feelings that I'm having 
and it's therapeutic for me to just sit and or stand and wash the dishes so and that's why i like washing dishes you guys let me know if you like washing dishes why you like washing dishes or if you prefer to just go ahead and stick everything in the dishwasher because i do have a dishwasher i just choose not to so let me know your thoughts down below
I didn't make too many changes in the bathroom, the only thing that I did do is I went and purchased another pack of the curtains. And I like to use Awesome as well as Comic Cleanser to clean the tub. And it does a pretty good job for me. But I felt like with those curtains, I felt like I was missing something. So it gave me just the right atmosphere that I was looking for in the bathroom. So I'm glad that I did go ahead and add the other two pairs of curtains. that it made with just having that curtain those other curtains added and it made everything brighter in the in the bathroom as well which is I really really like that and then oh I did add that plant right there that I have on the back of the toilet seat I did add that because it was something that was missing height wise and I like everything to be kind of balanced out so um, when I found that and I think I picked that up from Burks as well that's pretty much all we have out here in the mountains uh, as far as shopping we just have Burks and TJ Maxx and Walmart <laughs> So, uh, I mean, we have like big lots and things like that, but as far as a mall or anything like that, we don't we don't have that, no, no Target. So yeah, we have to go a couple hours either to Atlanta or Asheville or Tennessee to get our shopping done. As far as home, you know, home goods, we got to go to those places as well. So, yeah, most of my furnishings come from Burks. When I go to Home Goods, you guys know that. I've taken you along with me a few times. So, yeah, I, I'm kind of liking the bathroom this way now. It feels bigger, even though it's not the size that I'm used to, uh, because Georgia has a larger bathroom. So, yeah, this one is kind of small for my taste, but it works. I'm making it work. I think the best thing that I like in the bathroom yeah, are the fixtures that that acrylic in the marble dish dispenser and the cotton ball holder with the toothbrush holder. So those are my favorite pieces in the bathroom. And I picked those up from Bed Bath and Beyond. Oh, I said right the first time. <laughs> So guys, this is pretty much the end. I hope you guys enjoyed the clean with me and it gave you some inspiration. Maybe you have something set up that you, you know, 
kind of like the way I did things. And then just stay to the end because you'll see I did some clips that I've shown how everything looks now that it's been tidied up. And don't forget, let me know in the comment section um, how you like washing dishes, why you like washing dishes over the dishwasher or vice versa. And what decor have you added to your bathroom or to your living room area? And stay tuned for more videos from me. It's going to be sporadic because I got some things that going on in my personal life. And of course, I will share that with you all um, once everything calms down. Until then, stay prayed up. Pray for my family right now. Um, we're going through a lot right now. So pray for us and don't let anybody deter you from trusting in God, from knowing that He can work miracles that nobody else can. No doctors, no nurses, no lawyers, no one. No one has greater power. And stay fancy, stay lovable and beautiful as you are. And I will see you soon in another video. Thanks for riding with me, fancy beauties and bows.